What if a single photo could give you a fully editable 3D scene? Not just a shape, but distinct, meaningful parts you can modify, animate, or reuse. ByteDance and Carnegie Mellon just released Part Crafter. This AI model turns one image into structured 3D parts in seconds. Unlike existing tools that generate a single 3D blob or require multiple steps, Part Crafter does it all in one shot. No segmentation required. No two-stage pipeline. From one image, it generates multiple, separate 3D meshes, each semantically meaningful and geometrically distinct. Think legs, wheels, handles, props, all editable. Part Crafter uses a compositional generation model. Each 3D part is represented by its own set of latent tokens. The model understands how parts should look on their own and how they should work together. It combines local detail with global coherence, thanks to a hierarchical attention mechanism. The result? 3D assets that are both detailed and structured. It's built on a pre-trained 3D mesh diffusion transformer and introduces two major innovations. First, a compositional latent space where each part is disentangled and represented independently. Second, a local global denoising transformer that fuses features within parts and across the entire object. It even generates parts that aren't visible in the image using learned priors. Here are 10 wild examples from Part Crafter in action. A Lego Spider-Man figure. A dinosaur mech with moving parts. A full 3D room built from a single photo. A smartphone with detachable components. Another indoor scene reconstructed in full 3D. A crab mech with detailed claws and limbs. A third 3D room scene built from a single image. A battle axe with textured geometry. A humanoid character. And a Lego Darth Vader model, part by part. All generated from a single RGB image. No manual segmentation. No object annotations. Just one input. Part Crafter is a huge leap in 3D generation. Not just for objects, but for how AI understands structure. If you found this exciting, like the video, share it with someone who works in 3D or AI, and don't forget to subscribe for more cutting-edge AI updates.